Yeah! Uh, you know what it is. Black and yellow, black and yellow. Ooh, but right now, we about to get into some gangster stuff. That's right. Creepiest children's drawings, part five. That's about as gangster as it gets on this channel. Yeah, kind of sad. But I don't know what it is with these creepy children and these drawings, but maybe they weren't hugged enough as a child. Maybe they didn't get enough pudding at lunchtime. Or maybe they weren't beat with the belt. They should have been beat with the... That's what my parents did. My parents, they, you know, gave me spanking. They, they spanked me with the belt when I was bad, so, you know. Hey, shout out to my parents for, you know, um, making sure that I don't get into too much trouble. I don't know, but what I do know is that I just posted a brand new pic on Instagram. So if you guys get there, double tap on the new Instagram pic. I'm going to be following you guys back on my squads. Where you at, though? Where you at, though? Now, let's get into it and check out some more of these creepiest children's drawings. It's part five. Here we go. Let's do it. Okay, number one. <gasps> Katie? Who is Katie? My cousin drew this. I asked her who Katie is and she said, Katie's my friend who stands outside my window at, <gasps> at night. It's nighttime right now and it's 3 a.m. <laughs> And why is her name Katie? That's such a like basic white girl name. I mean, I mean not 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 white, but that's such, such a basic you know, hey girl going to Starbucks name, isn't it? I'm just saying. Maybe it's because her hair kind of looks like a lampshade. Like her hair is just kind of you know. I mean you know, come on girl, we gotta you know we gotta take care of that. Take Katie to the beauty salon. I'd be mad too. I mean, this is your friend who stands outside your window at night. I mean, I don't think this is what they're talking about when they said you've got a friend in me. You got. But seriously, Katie looks like every basic white girl before they've had their Starbucks. It's ridiculous. And what is this thing at the bottom right corner? Like, it's like a little, little devil's head. Like, what? Come on now. You know what? Maybe they'd be happier if they had a fidget spinner. I, I know it calms me down. I just, you know, chill, get the fidget spinner. Just look, you know, look at the flick of the wrist. Look at the flick of the Crazy kids. Quit drawing creepy Katies and, 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 and demons and stuff. Draw Scooby-Doo, dang it. Okay, let's move on to the next one. Here we go. Oh, scary lady. My parents always ask why I stare at them, but I'm staring at the scary lady behind them. What do you mean the scary lady behind them? All right, look, I'm not trying to make everything about race, but like, why does the scary lady have to be black? Like, say, I mean, come on now. Why can't it be like a creepy white scary lady? Why can't, why, why they always gotta be dark? Why are all the scariest things black? And why do the black people always die first in the horror movies? I wanna know. It says, mummy, daddy, me, scary lady. Who calls their mom mummy? Come on now. See, that's why you're being haunted by a scary lady because you call your mom mummy. Call your mom mom, all right? Dang. Or in my case, Dolores, all right? Shout out to my mom, Dolores. I'm just kidding. Man, I bet you if I see a scary lady, I'm breaking out the belt and now I'm just going, what? That'll scare him off. It sure scared me off when I was a kid, but anyway. Okay. Next one. Ah! What kind of drawing is this? What did I do to deserve this? To deserve looking at these drawings? <gasps> Why? Oh my gosh. I mean, seriously, how many shots of espresso did this chick have? I think it's time that you take a break from the Red Bulls. I mean, this, this, is, getting, this is getting insane. This girl looks like she's hooked on meth. Come on now. But let's be real. This is me at IHOP at 3 a.m. when I'm like super tired, I'm just like, Y'all got some pancakes? Give me some pancakes. I want some pancakes. This is also me after I stay up all night studying for a test. Yeah, you know who you are, Miss Wilkins. Okay, look, all I'm saying is if I had to wake up next to that every morning, we'd be breaking up real quick. All right, guys, let's keep going. Here we go. Another one. Oh, ew, ew, ew. What the? Oh, God dang. It says, I heard dad singing a lullaby to my sister in her room. But when I got there, this is what I saw. Oh no! Gee, you saw a pig holding a, a, a dang knife? This is what you see? Man, what are you guys, you guys gotta stop messing with those, those, 
those Ouija boards and all of them, you know, them stuff like that. Stop watching them horror movies, because this is what happens. I mean, this demon pig right here means business. I don't think he's going to be getting turned into bacon anytime soon. Okay, look, there's nothing scarier than a pig that stands upright holding a machete. I mean, come on. This, uh, what? I don't know if this pig is about to kill me or about to cook something or about to go through the jungle and like, you know, chop down some trees. Ha! Okay, low key, I kind of want some pigs in a blanket right now. Hey, Pumbaa. Timon and Pride Rock is that way. Man, I'm tired of all this demon stuff to ward off any, you know, weird stuff. I'm just gonna light a candle. Oh, what is happening? These are like cannibals. What the, is it mom, dad, Lucy? They're like eating the, the kid. My parents ate my sister Lucy. Ah! Ow, ow, this fire is hot. Fire is hot, yeah. Hey, my candle. This fire is hot and apparently water is wet. Okay, I'm fine with my parents just, you know, spanking me with the belt rather than eating me. Like what? These parents look like some angry gorillas and somebody just stole their banana. Y'all could really use a fidget spinner right about now. Maybe I could just, hey, hey, let me see if I can. Okay, I'm just gonna like, like. Ow, ow, my eye. Ah, ah, ah. This whole thing is scary and unnecessary. What was that? I'm starting to hear stuff. Okay, let's keep it going, here we go. What is that? Ew, no. No, God, please, no. It says, this is what I saw hovering over my bed last night. That's what you saw. Okay, I see glow in the dark stickers hovering above my bed at night. Like, and you see this? You doing something wrong, my boy. You need to cut it. Cut it, cut it, cut it. Dang, man, this guy looks like Skeletor. He's seriously looking at me like I owe him money and he's come to collect. Man, what is up with everybody and having these knives and these machetes and everything? Jeez. I mean, come on, anybody can kill somebody with a knife. Takes a real man to, or, or whatever this thing is, to kill somebody with the bare hand. Well, that, okay, that just sounds horrible. Don't, don't kill anybody. Okay, no joke, this thing looks like a Scooby-Doo villain. I'm waiting for them to take the mask off. I mean, come on, do you even knife, bro? I think he does knife, he's got a knife. I mean, this is some Call of Duty Black Ops Zombies type stuff. I ain't trying to be a part of it. Man, I ain't trying to play this game. Not today, maybe tomorrow. Hey, nice button up shirt, Skeletor. Come on, man, let's keep going and see what else we got. Ew, that's not so much scary, that's just kind of like, that's just weird. That looks, ew, that looks, ew, looks nasty. It says, I kill for blood. Okay, that'd be kind of weird to kill something and there was no blood. That'd be really, really weird. Hey, my candle! Okay, disclaimer, this is not like somebody who tried to draw me. That's not me, all right? Even though it kind of, you know, the shape of the head and the hair kind of looks like me. Actually, with them eyebrows, it looks like Drake. Drake, what you doing up in here, man? Killing for blood. Come on, man, you better get that out of here. There's blood on your teeth. That's nasty. I mean, man, somebody needs to take care of them them bloody, them bloody cavities, that, that gingivitis, I don't know what you have, but man, I mean, you need a, you need a, you need a brushy, brushy, brushy. This is like a sad cross-eyed clown. I mean, I, I don't understand like what they were trying to draw. Look, there are some disturbed kids out there, okay? A lot of disturbed kids who need some help, support, and love and care, all right? And by love and care, we all mean the belt. No joke, this thing looks like it just got a butt whooping by the belt. I mean, that's just crying. That, that's me after I got spanked by my parents every time. Okay, I swear, next time we're doing the happiest, the cutest kid drawings, okay? It's that creepiest kid drawings. I wanna see some cute drawings. I don't even wanna look anymore. Okay, here we go. Another one. <gasps> it's a decapitated head, man. Dang. I mean, come on, this is just ridiculous. This is how my mom used to grab my afro when she was mad at me. She'd be like, I'd be like, hey, hey, ow, ow, mom, stop, mom. Hey, come on, everybody, don't worry. Let's not lose our heads. <laughs> That's not funny. That's not funny at all. That was a, it's a very bad dad joke. But, you know, I was just trying to get a head. Oh! Okay, last one, here we go. Almost everything else I can handle, but when it comes to clowns, god dang it, no. It says my daughter brought this doll home. Oh, it's a doll, okay. We can't keep it because it keeps moving. <laughs> Why is the doll moving? 
And why is this clown smiling like that? He's smiling like he just got his braces off. Congratulations, by the way. Smiling like he just saved 15% or more on this car insurance. Look, I'm gonna tell you guys one thing. I better not get this, this clown as an Uber driver. Not trying to discriminate, but you know, I mean, just, I, I know all clowns aren't bad, but I just don't want to risk it. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I ain't got time to be dealing with clowns, okay? I'm sorry, I just got, you know, I'm, I'm trying to stay safe. All right, you know, you guys know the black man dies first, so I gotta take every precaution, man. Creepy clown dolls, man, you better get that out of here. Woo, that's it for the creepiest children's drawings part five. Yes, we did, I've done five of these, and it's something, um, you know, I might do another one, I don't know. Look, I'm seriously considering doing the cutest children's drawings, and then, you know, we'll see how that goes. You know, we'll, we'll, we'll try it out, I don't know. Let me know in the comments below. But I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you guys for getting to the video early and, and watching. I really hope you guys did not watch this at 3 a.m. like I did, because, you know, it's, it's super scary out here, and then, you know, got my blanket and got my candle I'm trying to I'm trying to stay safe make sure you guys are following me on Instagram and that you double tap and like the new photo that I just posted and I'm gonna be following you guys back on there all the cool kids are doing it got my Instagram right here and got it in the first link in the description below so go ahead click it and check it out Woo! but I'm gonna see you guys in the next video make sure to check out another one you can click right here or you can click right here click on the videos watch another one during the daytime or you can watch it at night if you want and be sure to click the bell next to the subscribe button button and turn on the notifications that way you get notified as soon as I post a new video click the circle in the middle to subscribe and click that bell to get notified and I'll see you guys in the next video till then peace